Now we're gonna move on to the sidewalls and take your sidewall strength, turn the head a little bit. You're gonna go from that first sidewall hole, put it through, and we're also gonna use that first diamond. So we're gonna come through, pull it. So that's part of that 10 diamonds that we had on the top. We're coming through that first hole and bring it down. You're gonna skip the next two sidewall holes coming through this one. You're gonna come through the mesh and then pull it nice and tight. What that's gonna do it, it's gonna lock the mesh in place so that your pocket's not gonna move around. You're gonna go down to the next one. Same thing, coming through the back of the mesh and pulling it nice and tight. You're gonna keep doing that down a couple more. Pull it nice and tight. Now I'm gonna switch over and start on the second sidewall, same as we did with the other. If you wanna hold both the strings now, you can take a look at the pocket that you're gonna have. Just kinda of work it in a little bit, see what kind of shape you want. So from here, we're just gonna keep going down, same as before, through the back. Pull it and lock it down nice and tight. Once more. I'm gonna flip it to the other side. Now since we're about the middle of the stick, and this is where we, we want the ball to sit, we're gonna go through this mesh a little bit differently. We're gonna double up now. So we're gonna come through this mesh hole. And then go through the next sidewall hole. And then come to the next mesh hole. So we're doing two diamonds in between here. This is gonna cause the mesh to bag out a little bit there. And that's where your pocket's gonna be. So we're gonna flip it around and do the same thing to the other side. Now we're gonna go back to singling, just one diamond through the back. Lock it down. We're gonna do that through the remainder of the stick. Now here at the bottom, we just have two holes left. I'm gonna teach you how to do a different way to put the bottom string in. We're just gonna come through this diamond for the second time pull it through, and then tie it off. That's gonna leave you with one unused sidewall hole down at the bottom. Now if you wanna take a look, now as you can see, the deepest point is where we doubled up. We used two sidewall holes right there. Thank you.